Hello everybody, Santa Claus here in Matangas. So uh, my wife just came over to me while I was watching uh, YouTube and uh, gave me some really bad news. Uh, I guess the neighbor Thelma, the one uh, lives directly in front of us. Um, she owns a beauty salon. Anyway, her, her husband is um, is Chinese, and um, we just heard he died. He's gone. Um, very sad. I just saw him the other day. He was hanging some laundry. He looked okay. He doesn't talk much. He doesn't do much. So maybe he's been sick and I didn't even know it. Because uh, they said he lost a lot of weight, but... I don't know, he always was kind of skinny to me anyway. But, um, some people are over there now. I guess uh, he's still inside the house. I guess, you know, it's Philippines, it probably takes a while for the ambulance or coroner or whatever to get here. But I'm not going over there and getting involved. Grace is over there now. Um, I don't know what help she is, but she's kind of friends with Thelma. And she's known Thelma for a pretty long time, since since she's been living here. So, uh, yeah. He wasn't that old. I don't even know how old he was, but he's, he's not old. He's probably, um, I don't know, he might be around my age. He looks older, but most people do around here. Um... So that's it. I really don't know any other details of exactly what he died from or what. I, I don't know. I can let you know in the next video. Um, just letting anybody here that watches my vlog in Tanawan or Natatis, if they want to know, if they do know Thelma's husband, um, yeah, he's gone. He's passed. Uh, also, um, no more really news on the Tao Volcano, still level 3, uh, there's no mandatory evacuations, um, whatever you've heard, uh, whatever you, whatever you might be watching, or other vloggers, or, I don't know, you probably probably watch them anyway and not me so maybe you're not getting this message because they all have more uh, subscribers than I do anyway but uh, I haven't heard any mandatory evacuations well, only uh, only voluntary evacuations and that's only really close to the uh, to the area um, we're fairly close here in Tanawan. I actually did a, a search on Google. There's Catherine in the back. Say hi. <laughs> hi, beautiful. Hi. So I did a search on Google just for curiosity of, uh, <laughs> okay, goofball. I'm talking to the people. Anyway, um, just for curiosity, uh, I, I looked, Catherine, I'm talking, please, um, and I put, uh, how far is it from Tao Volcano to Tanawan, and it came up, uh, 38 point something kilometers, which I don't know where they got that figure from, whether it's uh, midtown to now on, all the way to the tip of the volcano, or what. But uh, we're actually closer, being in Brangai Natatis here. And like I said in the last video, it only takes me 10 to 15 minutes by my scooter to get to like pretty much right in front of the volcano at Wawa Beach, Wawa Lake. 
which is all also considered Ta'al Lake. Um, so yeah, I, I'm a lot closer than 38K, no matter uh, what that map says, because I don't know what they base it on, Warrington I on. And uh, I haven't, I, you know, I've heard people say they smell rotten eggs, sulfur, the sulfur dioxide that's coming from the plume. But um, I really haven't smelled anything here. Now today's overcast and raining. Um, what? Yeah. And uh, it's still sprinkling right now. But I don't think it's because of the volcano. Uh, like I said, we haven't smelled anything. We haven't had any ash here. And I I watch a lot of YouTube videos, current um, people living closer by that are vloggers. And I also watch CNN Philippines, and they mentioned it on there. And they had an expert on there saying... Uh, the amount of earthquakes has, has have even decreased, and they don't don't even expect another eruption. And it was one just if you watch the YouTube videos, it was just one big plume that came out with steam and some ash. Um, but that's all it did, and they haven't raised the uh, threat level. Still number three, level three. So. Uh, I'll keep you guys constantly updated on that stuff. I'll tell you every day if there's any news. But there's no, there is no mandatory evacuations. Whatever uh, news you're reading, I can just tell you from living here. If there was, we'd hear about it. We'd hear about it here because we're close enough. Um, it's just voluntary. And it has interrupted again since, since uh, what, yesterday or the day before? The one little plume came out off of it. So I'll let you guys know if there's any more news on that or uh, on Thelma's husband. Grace is over there um, helping out. Um, that's good. That's good that she can do that. And... Uh, that's about it. Nothing else going on here. It's just a rainy, drizzly, overcast kind of day. And we're just going to hang out at home. It's Saturday here. And um, not much else to do. Just kind of dealing with this bad news. Um, I can't even remember her, his Thelma's husband's name. I just say Thelma's husband. Um... Yeah, so, I don't know, just uh, just stay in touch, keep watching, say a prayer, and um, stay safe. That's going to do it. God bless everyone. Santa Claus, here in Batangas, over and out. <laughs>